man thunder keeps rumbling in my ears i guess because it's uh day seven and the game's like yeah normally what i do on day seven is you know horde stuff so here we are not doing horde stuff the game i'm pretty sure is confused so let's go ahead and go inside and get rolling with a quest not quite sure why other than this is uh where i how <laughs> last parked after wrapping up the previous episode. Um, I guess we can take all that stuff. It's not really anything we particularly need, but, you know, that's fine. It doesn't always have to be something we need. It sounds like there's someone either on the other side of the wall or upstairs. I can't really figure out which it is. Any guests on the other side of the wall since they haven't come over yet? Should probably get all these cobblestones. So maybe what I can do is wait until we're about done with this place, and then if I remember, I can come and grab those cobblestones, because, you know, extra building materials always good. And even if it's cement, which I get tired of collecting because cement just takes so stinking long to turn into concrete. Sure, take all this stuff. I'm so spoiled for inventory space at this point, it's hilarious. Playing through Alpha 16.4 with standard backpack. Man, you can carry nothing in comparison. It's hilarious. Roll into Romero mod using a bigger backpack of 60. I mean, and that's not even the biggest backpack mod available. Oh man, I am just spoiled for choice. We can carry so much crap, it's amazing. Go ahead and scrap all those guys. We'll take those. We will modify that. Take that off of that guy. Wear that back on. Modify it. Throw that double pocket mod back on. Wear it again. And then scrap. Ooh, boy. That was... That was a good time is what that was. I have stepped into the room. Therefore, I have triggered some sleepers. Or at least a sleeper. Joe here. I'm going to kill Joe by bashing him in the knee. Ah. Who says you have to kill the, the zombies with headshots in Romero mod? Not I. Not I. Um, yeah, we'll take all those things. That's fine. Can we check the fancy turlet? Uh, sure, go ahead and take the water, too. I think I did a thing at some point. Maybe I forgot to mention it. I don't know. I think I was on the way back home from something an episode or two ago. And I ended up uh, just stopping to get some murky water since we were near a water source. So, my bad. Forgot to mention that. Seeing that murky water there reminded me like, oh yeah, that's right. I did a thing. Uh, sure, we can take all that stuff because we're just going to scrap everything and sell it anyway. Nothing behind that one. The one time I check and there's nothing to speak of. Okay, we have wound our way around in here. Let's go ahead and start marking things for scraps. That's going to be scrap that we can, I guess we can sell for 100, whatever. That will sell for a, a nice 347. And the rest of this stuff is pretty much, I guess it's just, it is what it is. This feels like a very narrow staircase to me. Hello, Burning Man. Oh, bye, Burning Man. Hello again, Burning Man. We're reunited. Okay. Yeah, that's what happens when you're not paying attention to the floor underneath you. Let's turn on the light so we can see. Maybe that'll solve part of the problem. I said part, not all. Because that floor just keeps, keeps falling, doesn't it? Okay. So we definitely heard these guys earlier, I think. Hello, kitty. Nice of you to join. Where is this last guy that I'm hearing? On top, I guess? Kind of sounds like it's up high. I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell. Sure. We'll take those things. We don't care, but we'll take them. We'll take those, too. Ooh, bandolier mod. That's good stuff right there. Here, let's go ahead and... I don't think we have room. So, no. Let's not go ahead and do anything. 
Can I get out here to figure out where this last guy is? Because you sure sound like you're up there. And you're not. So where are you? I don't, I don't know where you are. You're directly underneath right there. Okay. I'm not sure where that is. So let's drop down a little bit, I guess, huh? Did we miss this room? I guess we did. We didn't get in here. I hear you, dude. I hear you. I think you might be on this level. I'm not sure. Here. Let's just go ahead and break into this room right here. Let's see if anyone's in here. Ah, uh, sounds like it might be lower now. It's alright. We'll break in. Okay. Alright, let's go downstairs and see if he's here. Where are you, dude? Um, one of you might be the one we're looking for. Not sure. Not you. You. You're the one we're looking for. My goodness. Oh, hi. Let's go and get rid of you. Oh, that's right. I was supposed to get some of these, so... Meet you back at the trader. For the most part, we're doing a pretty good job of keeping them warm out here, which is good. Improved fittings mod or a single pocket mod? I'm gonna say... that none of these really matter. I mean, the improved fittings mod, we're not... Probably going to be using heavy armor would be my guess. Especially in a mod where the zombies are not sprinting. I don't really see the value in having heavy armor. Uh, and yet a single pocket mod does nothing. Um, sure, we'll take that for now. It, it, it doesn't matter. Let's get rid of some of these things that we can sell. Um, machine gun parts, rocket launcher parts. I'm fine with getting rid of those guys. He won't buy that. He will buy that. And that gets us to a pretty decent spot on our inventory. Okay. Now, I think we've already checked his inventory because I vaguely remember Hobo Stew. So Thanks since we don't have anything here. else, let's Coming go ahead here. and see if you have any jobs. Got a tier one clear right can nearby. Sure, we can do that one. I don't know that we're actually going to go do it, but we can we can do that. I mean, it's the joy of Alpha. I don't know when did that change? Was it twenty when that changed with the the traders basically each trader having their own sort of a inventory of quests, so to speak. Get rid of all these guys. We don't need any of them. I'm kind of listening in just to the sounds of everything to see, you know, are we going to get anything? I mean, we're not supposed to have a horde, and yet it's very horde weather-like. Oh, there's a wandering horde coming through. I hear that. Yeah, here it is. There we go. I was trying to find the horn. So I could draw them away. I feel like a, a conductor of an army of clowns right now. Come on. Come on, guys. And we'll just keep honking and drive them away from the traitor. Perfect. Perfect. I think they're probably far enough now that it's not an issue. Okay. Let's just go ahead and... Uh, go somewhere else out here. Like I said, we're not necessarily going to go hit the trader. Um, I do kind of want to go over to, or the, uh, the quest, rather. I do kind of want to go over to the quest, just because it's in a part of town we have not yet seen, so I'm okay with opening up some additional options for us. Oh, this is not a bad little POI, either. I mean, if you don't mind fighting a zombie bear, or at the very least, a bear... Maybe not a zombie bear, but definitely a bear. And then this is going to be a problem because... Oh. Those things are stupid and can fly infinitely fast until they get in front of you and get run over by a mini bike. Duh. 
Oh yeah, that was a little too close to all those landmines there. Which one is that? Oh, it's that one. Okay. It's not what I thought it was. Is that the man there? Yeah, dog snake pig. Dog sneak pig. It is that one. Oh, Aldo's cabinet has some decent little stuff in it too. I mean, it's not earth shatteringly good, but uh, there's. I remember there being some decent stuff in there. There's like a little bit of a, a thing on the roof. Yeah, let's get rid of some of this stuff here. I was trying to eat some of this food. And uh, I guess we can go ahead and finish off with the bacon and eggs. I know, probably shouldn't have eaten the chili. Not all that worried about it. Here, let's get rid of you because you don't matter. Pork bites, we'll put our honey in there because, you know, you know and stuff. There we go. We'll call that good enough. Will be a few birds in here, if I remember correctly, along with some other things. Like I said, it won't be until we get to the top floor that we really get our loot. So, oh, look at that. Excellent. Got ourselves a, a potential wrench upgrade. We'll have to look at that in a minute and see if it is an actual upgrade. Madam. Answer. Perfect. Good job. Uh, we'll scrap all those things, and I know it'd be nice to be able to take them back. Not sure to what end, but it would. Every once in a while you need some additional cooking pots, or the nails especially, but we can just make nails, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, this is some really intense music. Unnecessarily so, for a single zombie. Oh, that was not at all obnoxious. Not in the slightest, all right. So we can see a dude there. And we can see a dude right there. And we got a dude coming in. Okay. Game is turning into a stuttery mess right now. I have a bit of a theory on that, actually. And I would love... If uh, you would tell me what, what you're using. Because apparently not everyone gets the same stuttery mess stuff I do every time zombies appear. Sorry, I had to sneeze there, so I had to mute my microphone. But I kind of am working on um, a very, very weak hypothesis with literally no evidence whatsoever to suggest that maybe it's AMD CPUs that have that problem. Because if you're playing with an Intel CPU, based on my my staggering evidence of uh, talking with one person specifically who has an Intel CPU and doesn't see these same issues I do, I wonder if that's what's going on. So, let me know if you get the, the stuttering mess of Alpha 20.x when zombies appear, because... Man, I sure do. I mean, that'd be a real, real shame if it was because of uh, my CPU, but I wouldn't put it past this game. I would not. Oh, dang it. I was just about to grab that arrow. I was I saw the bag there. I'm like, wait a minute, what is that? Oh, I think it's an arrow. And just as I read it was an arrow, it vanished. That's fine. Oh, uh, come on, buddy. Speaking of arrows. Oh, man, yeah, see? Stuttery mess right now. You can just tell I'm, like, bouncing around. The hilarious thing is, like, the game itself is running mostly fine. It's just this, this stutteriness. It's like I'm dropping a ton of frames, but I'm not. At least not in... Not from the, the general perspective of recording when you say dropping frames and all that. Yoink. Grab the arrow. Um, I guess we can grab the bag of those things. Gobbly stones. Okay. Now we can go out right here and there will be a bird if I remember correctly. At least one out here. There should also be a backpack or something, potentially. Here we go. There's our bird. That is very satisfactory. 
there's the other one. Also, quite satisfactory. Um, you shouldn't have tried to go in there. That was your first mistake. Oh, hello. How did you get over here? I mean, seriously. How did you get over here? Yeah, see, look at this. I'm just dropping frames left and right. Guess I need to do more research on my hypothesis and see if it's actually a thing. Alright, I caught you coming out of the building this time, madam. I want to kill as many of them as possible because I don't think the game run better. I mean, I really don't want to build a new computer. Like, I don't. I do, but I don't. But, I mean, come on. Let's go ahead and go around the back side here. Trigger everyone. Oh yeah, I knew that was going to miss as soon as I let go. Alright. Need you to back away, sir. Oh yeah, here comes the crazy intense music. Okay. Bash away and bash away. I'm watching stamina. We're good so far. And we'll do a super smash. Ah, stop blocking it. These zombies that hold up their hands, man. They're the worst. Free wood. Free metal. Free terrarium. Okay, we already checked that guy, so let's go around the back here. We're not cold. Trust me. Uh, I don't really think we want coffee seeds. I'm, I'm not going to do any sort of uh, farming type stuff. That's just not going to happen. Did a fair amount of farming in Alpha 16.4, and that was uh, that was okay. In Alpha 20, it's awful, and the devs should be ashamed of themselves. Craft fireman helmets and take 5% less damage when wearing them. Yes, please. Ooh, the water purifier mod. That's also a stellar find right there. Tempered blade schematic. 9mm weapons have 20% more range when using a scope for iron sights. That's good stuff right there, too. And another grave digger. Some ammunition. And now we can uh, get down here, I guess. Uh, that did good damage to her. I mean, wasn't great. But no, that, that worked pretty nicely. Yeah, no complaints about that. Hey, buddy. I wonder if you're the guy that we saw way out front. Yeah, I knew that was going to miss. Uh, that's fine. I'm just going to leave him. Because we've got to repair weapons and things anyway. Now, let's switch to this guy just in case we need something on the way out. All right, I'm going to stop and repair that and repair that. And go ahead and eat that. And scrap that. And drink one of that. There we go. We don't really need that much water, I don't think. But it'll be fine. So let's do a quick comparison here. 42-1. 38-3. That is the better one. We can modify that to put a grave digger on there, which I know. That sounds hilarious. I'm going to dig up some dirt with a wrench. Well, technically, it's possible to do that. It just depends on your definition of dirt. So let's go ahead and run back to the trader one more time today. And we will stop along the way to check this mailbox. Not a thing worth it, worth checking out. Okay. Oh yeah. It just dawned on me that wasn't actually a quest. That was just me wanting to go into that POI. Um... Here, let's do a quest. This should only take a minute. Okay. Pick up the rock. Nothing else of interest out of here. Some stones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is going to be get up here, get up here, jump up here, climb up here, and deal with the bird. Okay, no problem. No problemo. Let's go ahead and just drop down. I am... I'm going to unceremoniously run through and smash everyone here. No respect for any zombie in here. It is just a mad smash and bash. See? That's what I'm talking about. Hey. 
take all the things, even though we already have the book. Um, take those things. Seeds we don't care about. Like, seriously, seeds just... I don't even care about them. Screw up that guy. Where was that coffee seed we picked up? Did I, did I put it down or not pick it up? There you go. Do not want. Do not want. These guys are going to destroy something at this rate. Uh, so here, let's do a loud grab on all of that stuff. They doing? Come on out. Smash and smash. Like I said, this is just an unceremonious smash everyone in the way, because I don't even care. I... Nope. Missed that. That was my bad. Sinky sink. Definitely take some scrap metal. And let's go over here. Let's... Whoever is waiting behind the counter. Oh, that guy. That looked brutal. Okay. Madam. That's how little I am interested in spending time in here right now. Okay. So we have done the quest. We can actually go back to the trader now for real this time. For realsy reals. And get some sort of reward, which... I mean, I'm okay with that. Um, leather gloves. Oh, that's, that's really good because I don't think we have any... Any sort of... Uh, hand armory stuff. Yeah, no, that's good. Can we modify you and put that armor mod on there? Excellent. I'm very pleased to see that. That's really good right there. I mean, we don't really have spare points for like the next 60 or 70 levels, so anything we can find like that right now is just fantastic. All right. We have done good work in here. I forget. Uh, nope, that's not the fast way. I don't know if this is the fast way, but it is what it is. This is good real world timing because my laundry hey, just Dad. finished, so I Here need to go take reward. care of that. Uh, I owe you one. We already have the book, so I guess we'll take the shotgun choke mod. There's something that I meant to do last time and didn't, so we can check with that right quick. Uh, what are you, household bungalow? I, mean, I really don't want to keep doing those. Household modular? Not really. What about you? Household modular too? I mean, I guess if we're going to do one, we might as well do the closest one. But we might not be doing that anyway. So here, let's sell you that guy. I don't even care about the pipe pistol. I'm pretty sure we have one back at the base anyway. So I'm just not going to sweat that. The rest of this stuff... Uh, we might keep the stun baton for a little while. That one's kind of fun. I do like me a stun baton. Oh, you know what, here, um, that is steel club parts, so no, we'll keep that, because we got some, some random parts just lying around. I meant to try this. Yeah, there we go. We can put the shotgun choke on that guy. We got one last time around, like, I say last time, I mean, could have been like three episodes ago, and I just forgot to put it on there, that's all it was. I remember seeing that and going, yeah, we should put that on there, even though I think I said it was useless and we had no use for it. Nah, I knew that, I just meant to put it on there and totally forgot. Oh, I was supposed to sell those shades. Putting those guys in there so we don't accidentally sell them, because those we do want. And then that has to go on chest and leg armor, not boots. So that we can leave in there. Bow, crossbow parts, good stuff. So I guess we'll just go ahead and leave it right here. I'm going to get rid of these shades. We will catch up on the next one. Probably not running a quest, at least not right away, because... I'm really not trying to just power through nothing but quests. I feel like that gets kind of old and it's, uh, in some ways, it's a little bit of an exploit to me. Trader quests and the rewards for them are just massively, massively overvalued in my estimation. So, I don't know. I kind of like to run around and just do a little bit of uh, old school looting too, just to kind of balance out how much crap we get for free from doing these incredibly menial tasks. I mean, come on. When they give you like 60 shells or 60 uh, 9mm rounds or something, yeah, that's a little much. Catch you next one. Until then, thanks for watching. See you later.